Oh, we're going to a hukilau in Laie. The centuries-old fishing technique hasn't been practiced in the area in more than 60 years, but today a group did just that at Hukilau Beach. KITV4's Shinili Kabir tells us they were there for a film crew shooting an upcoming documentary. He would wave to us like this. So all us kids do that? That's how it got catchy. Shaka, a story of aloha, is based on a master fisherman and, as many say, the creator of the shaka, Manhamana Kalihi who lost his middle three fingers in an accident and greeted people with just his thumb and pinky. Officials say although many people use the shaka symbol, not many know where it actually came from and that many locals have never been to a real hukilau. With respect to the shaka gesture, only 8% of people here know where it came from. That's a very small percentage of our population, not to speak of the world, yet the world knows this gesture. The first nets went out to the ocean at 9 a.m and hundreds of people joined in the effort. I just heard there's gonna be a hukilau over here. And so I know in commemoration of my great grandpa, Hamana Kalili, and so my family came over here for support and we all come together as a community and help support and pull together to try to catch, catch fish. Event coordinators said this type of fishing isn't used very often. And it was rewarding seeing the community come together to participate in this tradition. Successful is not about how much you catch. It's more about the community that comes out and the atmosphere that you have, I, I say. Kind of neat. It's, I think they, they got a lot, a lot more people here. Than, they didn't get, get quite a good catch, but, you know, it was fun. It's the, all about the experience. Producers say the shaka meaning is richer than what we're seeing. And that's what they want to focus on in this documentary, to keep this icon alive. Shanila Kabir, KITV4 Island News.